AOE, big crits, big late game, explosive plays all around from Envy's team. Definitely true. G, camp in there, see if they poke out early, get a nice chunk on them. I think they're gonna go for the maneuvering for this that he's behind in experience. He's actually able to get behind Frog and Flash dodges the first bit of it. And Frog is able to get in the never oh. catches the bolt. Roxon takes a lot of damage. The burn is ticking. Toast. First blood for hard. The counter engage huge. They spent so much time and fully committed to that. Oh, teleport deep. Keith is in trouble. Oh boy, Keith is gonna be walking into Seraph. He oh. tries to flash to kite it out. There goes Seraph looking for the final, but Keith gets a kill. Missing I gotta get another one. Oh, oh, he's finally going to drop. They might try to convert it on the big. Now he's able to walk it out. KFO up on the top side. Playing for the Infernal Drake. Mm -hmm. Pretty good prize to settle for. Patience pays off. Oh, Ninja actually. Oh, he's pinned against the wall right now and is forced to use the soldiers to dash over and has accumulated a 20 CS lead. Froggen's actually TPing in from behind a deep ward at the blue and button. One teleport. Shen ready to come in as well. Yeah, waiting from behind. Spell shield blocks the tidal wave, but there's the long range engage. KFO hops in. Lod will go down to Keith Snipes. It. Trying for a rebuttal there, but Keith's constant pressure pays off in the bottom lane. And Echo Fox convert. Whoa, Froggen gets slid into Proxen. Doesn't, Doesn't have any summoners, though. Has it's healing from his ult. He's healing it right back up. KFO actually hops in. He's going to try to turn on the Proxen, who doesn't have a flash. Oh. Well, he's looking for the kill. Will he be able to catch up hard? Uh, built attack damage. Gets to destroy this turret very quickly. Press. Lift. Steal away. Yeah, Echo Fox, they're making decisive calls this game. They're actually oh. trying to turn things around. Step but Envy two. are doing the same as Proxen again ganks Froggen in the mid lane get those solo kills. They've got a really big minion wave. They might try to Four break down people, the turret. though, that's not a solo. There's a teleport. KFO is gonna be knocked up and burned through, but Froggen gets in just a little too late. Tidal wave catches Seraph, who reposts the bubble, and now Envy are trying to back away. Oh! Arn gets the cask and separates them back in. Proxen goes low. He's finally going to drop, <laughs> but it's a one-for-one -one trade. His hard goes down. They, they have Sivir up on the top side, so they're definitely giving up on it. I wonder if they actually dive Shen, though, Kefo is still away as the tier two is going to go down. So Envy trade the Infernal Drake for a tier two in the long run. Quite sure. I think maybe one more auto and uh, oh. Hard might have lived. Whoa! Yeah, this time Seraph though, bounce back. He drops the Grand Challenge onto Froggen, but Challenge is not going to be enough to keep him alive. Back Just to the wall. Don't Froggen let him get the vital. The vitals. There's the Repos. Froggen <laughs> finally able to kill him with a killing spree. Meanwhile, in the middle, they don't for the risky play. Uh, Sivir is able to rotate up in that time, but they Whoa. take the turret. Froggen decides to commit to the dive. The turret finally falls. There's the stand united, freshly empowered. He flashes to chase Lod, who makes it over the wall. But Seraph in the back line finds Keith. He's not able to proc any vitals throughout the chaos. Finally, he drops it, and he's able to heal himself back up. And he's and out! Escape! Broxen will be able to try to turn it around in the front. Hard is going to drop. That's two for one so far in the tidal wave for disengage. Oh my goodness, just track Seraph in that fight. Trying to pick up the scraps here as they start to lose control of mid lane as well. Yeah, and Sivir. KFO lands a taunt onto Seraph. He eats a bit of damage before getting away from the turret. Snare catches Lon. Oh, but there's the Emperor's Divide. Who's going to eat the bullets? This is going to be a really painful fourth bullet. Hmm. Oh, and they're repulsed. Seraph. And Karma Speed, able to shift the enemy team, takes Elder Dragon. But right now, Echo Fox taking more Drakes in this. Ooh, that nice shot there from Fox. Oh, oh, oh my Hakuho. He's going to be taking a lot of damage as Fro uh, Ninja will get away from the cast. They finally got one of I like it with the buffs of Trinity Force, actually very good on Fiora. Cooldown and attack speed. Oh, all right. Grand challenge. Good way to block the vitals, but it's not going to last very long. Seraph procs all of them and heals up, but he doesn't have enough mana to make that an extended trade. That vital against the wall to deny Seraph. Spirit sword versus whatever weird laser sword? Laser sword project. Oh. Wields. Curtain call drop down the mid lane. Seraph. Oh, might try to look for it as the rest of Echo Fox pressure down the mid lane. Finally, it's going to drop. Seraph is at remarkably low health, though, but mid tier two remains falling, and Seraph solo kills KFO. Takes the dirt and cleans up the Shen. Order is soon to follow. Can they stop the recalls?
Froggen will be interrupted. No one's recalling. Froggen's actually caught out. He's going to be pulled back in. The Zanyas means he's pre preventing most of the damage, and he's able to flash the wall to escape with his life. But Seraph... Inhibitor's toast. Yeah, no one is touching him. He's going to be able to clear out this inhibitor with the hero play in the bottom lane. It's actually mean to you. Oh, man. It was all... King Arthur and place long enough. Yeah, shows himself bottom. Seraph immediately just kites it back out before turning back on the inhibitor. KFO makes a frowning face as they it got... goes down, but Envy shoved yeah. down the mid lane, I take mean, down the inhibitor turret and the inhibitor. No fight. It, it's even more difficult. Like, there's zero time. Uh oh, there's on the hunt. Baron Buff is uh, about to wear off. Flash means Envy are able to kite it out. They all line up behind Proxen. In and the Nexus turrets, as you said, escorted in by Seraph are taking a lot of damage. He's actually able to break it down. One versus two. How many games do Echo Fox have to... Oh, there's a oh, title wave. Going. Flash engage. They immediately turn on the Keith, who's chunked down to half. But Proxen will be able to get away. The snare misses, but Seraph is in the back line. Keith is going to be defended by both Big and KFO, who are trying to chase Seraph down. Meanwhile, Froggen split from his team. Zones away, Ninja and the rest of Envy ends up being a kill for Echo Fox, but they're they're losing their base. Fighting them off though. Yeah, they did lose a Nexus turret. So they lost some ground. But you know, Froggen's 503. <laughs> he is, he is. He's got good numbers as usual. Ah, uh, there's the play. Hard tried to go for it. Uh, Quite see the ninja cleanse out of the uh all right well um, didn't have anything for that stopped, bubble so by the bubble yeah, and the from hard on the initiate there was a cleanse and a spell shield good so many wards for envy and they kill it so ridiculously fast this is they're gonna go for it you gotta go oh it's gone uh, already yeah. secured a little bit too slow frog and races in with the home guard ninja drops the divide keith again going to be targeted by seraph who's now one versus four frog doing the same on the opposite side seraph has got the guardian angel though frog is low oh. he's finally going to be shut down by ninja they seraph two, caught by the bubble proxy goes down seraph is going to get the repost will they be able to kill him though double kill for ninja lot cleans it up a big chase the bubble is spell shielded oh. and lot chases forward Oh, the heal! Oh, body my God, slam, he's body slam. Oh, oh, finally, kill secured by Lot. It's one versus on our longest Friday night ever. Envy looked like they're gonna walk it in. Two, one, take the series over Echo Fox. Yeah, the Nexus turrets go down. The Nexus falls, and Envy. Recovering from their past two weeks, one and three performance, finally able to take a win back again in two very long games. Defeat Echo Fox. The end of that fight. As Seraph shake, shakes hands all the way down, Echo Fox. Echo Fox did look a lot better over the course of that series. In game one, we finally saw them make some decisive plays and decisive calls. But then over the course of the series, we saw them sort of regress with those old patterns and struggle with it. Yeah. Uh, now they've got more material to work with. You yeah. know, Heaven Time the Coach on there uh, with the rest of the